I don't know whose water guns are these, but I think Havana Socials is having something fun here. And this is your host, Worry of Drink or Die Thailand. Have you ever paired rum with chocolate before? Well, Bacardi Thailand and Card Coco hosted a rum and chocolate tasting for rum fans at Havana Social. And what you're looking at is a roasted cocoa bean. This is what it looks like before being turned into chocolate. At this stage, the cocoa is edible. So I tried it and it was bitter and sour at the end. Glasses are filled, an indication that they're ready to start. Card Coco's COO, Leo Sebeck, introduced himself and the brand. Right, so we have uh, beans that are coming from different parts of Thailand, uh, including Shumpan, Factory of Chantabui and Chiang Mai. And all these beans give very different uh, flavor profile to chocolate. After Leo's introduction, we took on board Padung Si Sawat. Brand ambassadors of Bacardi Thailand introduced himself and led the guests to taste the first rum, Bacardi Anejo Cuatro. To pair with this rum, toasted coconut chocolate of 70% cacao from Brachuap Kirikan province was chosen due to the chocolate and rum sharing coconut character. A refreshing cocktails of Bacardi Quattro to wash them down. Next, deeper and more matured Bacardi Reserva Ocho or Bacardi Ocho was paired with hazelnut and coffee chocolate of 70% cacao from Chiang Mai province. And this pairing was followed by another cocktail. This time was a spirit forward cocktail, kind of like nutty and chocolatey rum negroni. Thank you, Gabriel. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Last but not least, Bacardi Grand Reserva Diaz, or Bacardi Diaz, which was paired with cinnamon cordial and orange peel chocolate of 70% cacao from Chumpon province. To finish the session, we needed a toast. After the rum and chocolate tasting, I finally knew whose water guns they were. 